This is Soundfall, a rhythm-based, top-down, twin-stick shooter that is procedurally generated to music. Soundfall opens with our first hero, Melody Harper, a singer-songwriter with intense stage fright, as she is whisked away to the musical land of Symphonia to save the Symphonians from the evil armies of Discord. In Soundfall, players are rewarded for performing actions to the beat of the soundtrack. Offbeat actions will still work, just not as well. In fact, player movement is just about the only player action that doesn't have to follow the beat, as Melody is demonstrating for us right now. But when attacking and dashing, Melody loses quite a bit of power when she doesn't follow the beat. When it comes to interacting with the environment, offbeat actions just don't work. If you really want to blast, smash, and dash with some oomph, you gotta keep the beat. The first levels of Soundfall take place in the Skylands environment. Each environment in Soundfall has a specific musical genre like heavy metal, EDM, classical, etc. For example, the Skylands are a collection of floating islands full of pop music, Melody's favorite. As you can see, Melody is quite a bit more effective when she plays on the beat. Something else you might notice playing Soundfall is that most of the environment moves to the beat. This is intended to help the player stay on beat the same as the metronome at the bottom of your screen. But more than that, we wanted to deepen the connection between the environment and the music for the player. After all, this is Symphonia, the world of music. One of the best things about Soundfall is the musical weapons that players can discover, starting with the Instruments of Harmony. Here we see Melody unlocking her own Instrument of Harmony, the Audio Blade. Besides Melody, Soundfall also features four other Guardians of Harmony, each with their own unique set of abilities and attacks. With five characters to choose from, one thing is certain. Discord had better watch out. Soundfall offers two to four player online and couch co-op with difficulty and encounter styles that scale to match the level and number of players. More than that, players will be able to drop in on free play and campaign mode levels hosted by their friends and retain the rewards, loot, and experience they generate even if they aren't hosting the game.
and Soundfall is a richly rewarding experience in co-op, as the characters' individual playstyles and ultimate abilities offer a variety of strategic options in co-op. Holy smokes! Soundfall loot comes in four varieties. Beat blasters, the main projectile weapons that players use, armor, instruments of harmony, and overdrives, which power the hero's ultimate abilities. Soundfall loot comes in five levels of rarity. White, the most common, and then green, then blue, then purple, and then orange, the rarest of them all. The rarer the item, the more likely it is to have special power-ups that will aid you in your fight against Discord. Soundfall loot varies in musical timber as well. In addition to the default variant, you might also find bolero, serenade, minuet, requiem, or nocturne variants of familiar loot, each with their own unique strengths and weaknesses. With all this loot, loadout strategy is very important in Soundfall. The Guardians of Harmony are powerful and well-equipped but Discord has sent its most powerful monsters to destroy Symphonia. Throughout Soundfall, players will do battle against a diverse cast of Discordian threats. Some of them fast, some of them slow, some of them enormous, and all of them deadly. To make matters worse, Soundfall's enemies like to attack in waves. This horde-style gameplay can quickly overwhelm even the most seasoned gamer, so watch out. But all of these threats pale in comparison to Soundfall's big bad, a mysterious lieutenant of Discord named Banshee, who commands the Discordian army but has secret goals of her own. Soundfall will ship with a free play mode featuring more than 100 songs. We've partnered with Epidemic Sound for the bulk of our tracks, but we also have licensed dozens of tracks from independent musicians. Everything from prog rock to jazz to rhythm and blues, multiple forms of electronica and metal, classical and hip hop. There's something for everyone in Soundfall. And more than that, there's enough diversity of music to guarantee that each gameplay environment has its own unique feel and culture. One of the coolest features on Soundfall for PC is the ability to import your own music. As we mentioned before, Soundfall is procedurally generated to music, and with Soundfall's import feature you have the ability to create your own levels from music or even sound files that you have on your hard drive. Here we see a forest level that has just been created by Soundfall's algorithm to match the sound, length, and feeling of George Cohen's Give My Regards to Broadway, released in 1904. Which means, by the way, that it is in the public domain. And 
that, folks, is Soundfall, releasing soon on PC and all major consoles from Drastic Games. Thanks for watching.